What up, YouTube families? Your man Carlos here from K Exclusive. Uh, if anybody's new watching, we are located in New Jersey. Um, New Jersey. <laughs> nice. Take two. <laughs> Beep. What up, guys? Your man Carlos here from K Exclusive. Anybody new that's watching, uh, we're a sneaker resale store, boutique. For all the hot and limited edition sneakers, we're located in New Jersey, a couple stores. Instagram always posted in the comments, description, and we're gonna put it right here low for a couple that we have. But enough talk, let's, um, today's video, if you see right behind me, we got a wall of ones. We got Hey Yo Milton in the building. Hey Yo Milton. Yo, yo, yo. Hey Yo Milton. Hey Yo Milton. Yo, yo, yo. I just cashed out over what? 300 pairs of mochas? So we did a little buyback today. We're always buying. So if you're trying to sell, make sure to bring it to us. You can ship it, bring it to any other stores, and uh, we'll catch you out. Today we just got, let me see them. You know, Undisputed Champ, Mocha Ones, one of the most iconic shoe, fire. One of the hottest ones, honestly. Hottest, selling crazy, especially for, for the summer. So I got a call, yo, they had about 500 pairs. They wanted to keep some, so we bought in total maybe like 400 and change it was about a little over 300 in mochas and then we got a couple uh university blue so which is your favorite which one do you guys like mocha university blue i say go with the mochas facts but mocha is curly just because of the black not know, even that because it looks like a travis scott that's why it's so hot in the and, i mean travis scott travis scott nah it's just the color yo mocha color any any shoe with if they they made a baby blue like that with the black toe vibes fire that was a cool viral so guys um before we get to the rest of the video we're giving out make sure you like comment always subscribe we appreciate the love and support but we're gonna give away hundred dollars to uh, anybody in the comments so you can get a hundred dollar cash app PayPal however you want it whatever you got or 150 store credit if you're local and you want to shop with us come through we got you and last video's winner we're gonna post it right here. Boom, congrats to my man. And um, let's continue with the video, guys. So we're gonna do a little giveaway. If you could guess how much we spend, make sure to put it in the comments. We'll give away, if, oh, uh, oh shit. We'll give away a mocha or university blue one, whatever you guys think. What do you think, Melon? What should we give away? Mocha for sure. Oh, we'll let you pick, make it easy for you. But let's, um, we organize and stuff like that. Definitely we're in one of our warehouse. A lot of stuff around, a lot of stuff that we like to uh, hold on to. There's a couple of stuff, but we got good deals, we hold on to it. Like right now we got, what are these? Black uh, black and gold University Nines. Nines, oh, nines always do good, especially in the store selling. What do you think, Milton? For sure. That was a good one actually, that I just recently released. We, we probably got like, what, 200 pairs left? So, we like to, um, this is where we put whatever we get left over or we think is a good shoe, we got a good price, just to hold it to see uh, the value go up. A lot of ones we hold, a lot of other things like that. 12s, 13s. This is one of my all time favorite and we're going low, but we had a whole bunch of them. I remember, I remember uh, back when it released, I skipped school to get these joints, right? And, the, and then the problem was, uh, <laughs> that Monday came up and well I skipped school by the way because I was able to get it a little early I got it like that Friday I had a little plug they gave it to me before but then Monday came up and everybody had this shit in school bro I was sick but what I did was you know stashed them away for like a year or two after everybody got beat up and then whooped mine out but one of my old time favorite shoes Flint 13 we, we, we stacked we stack. the blue ones <laughs> goodbye we'll take no, no. I, I'm picking the blue ones. I'm just saying, you never know. <laughs> nah, those, those is I, but is a new, is a new release. A little chilly in here, guys. You know, we, we keep it cold to preserve the shoes. What is even the word? <laughs> it's brick in here. It's brick. What else we got in here? We got these two. These are the Royal Thirteens. What got you in sneakers, man? It's funny, I've always been into sneakers. Never bring into Jordans. I've always rocked, you know, Air Forces, LeBrons. What else? Uh, phone pauses back in the day. Then Jordan started kicking in, and I just got into Jordans. 
But I was always a sneakerhead at the end of the day, guys. It's not all about jewelry, it's not all about Yeezys. At the end of the day, it's what you like. Text you me feel me? Wear what you like at the end of the day. See, I got something comfy on today, nothing crazy, but comfy, Yeezys are always comfortable. What else we got here? 700s, we got Flantums. We're just sitting on Yeezys, bro. It's crazy. I just got, what was these? 500s? High top joints. I could go on for days, guys. The white Supreme Air Forces. Oh, yeah, I saw you on TikTok with it. Got the white ones. Gotta have the black nasties to go with them, too. I'm taking the white. But which one are y'all taking? Black or white? You guys let me know in the comments down below. Royal Toes. Another classic one here. What else we got here? I have one question, Milton. Yes, sir. Uh, why the Royal Toes, do, like, they don't got the paper? Royal Toe? There's no, that means it's fake. Boss, man, one question. Uh, the Royal Toes, they don't got the paper. When uh, you want to preserve a shoe, always take away the paper. It's going to make the midsole yellow faster. Come on, man. That's, that's a good one. That that's sneaker one? What you mean? That's, that's a fact. No, it's, oh, it's true, though. That's the reason. I got a whole bag full of papers. I think all these Royal Toes got no papers. Look at that. Anything that I, that I want to stash away for like a couple years, I take off the paper. I used to uh, Ziploc bag them. <clears throat> yeah, I used to do that too, yeah. But nah, it's not. Leather got to breathe. So it kind of like messes them up too. But with the cold environment and that, it, you could Doesn't leave, you could leave them for that you also call like the, like the glitter on the shoes the paper after a while? Yeah, so the glitter on the shoe that comes is, is, the, is the black paint. Okay. So a anything that Jordan got black, mostly ones and stuff like that, like I know the, the bright black ones. leather, I guess the paint they use for the leather to dye it, it, it leaves that residue. Because I've seen it actually on black fours mm -hmm. with the leather, and then they leave that, we call it a stripper glitter. If, if any OG collector knows, we're gonna, we're gonna, I don't think I got anything here because of how we preserve it, but uh, a couple of, a lot of band ones already, a couple years. The the band ones, a lot of things got glitter all over them things. Right. We got a pair at the store, actually. We'll show you later. That's how you know they're true, uh, real, because it's the, the, uh, the ink that Nike uses to um, to make it like that. Motion, I like your hoodie. You already know, bro. Conclusive merch. You want nah, exclusively, man. you got to ask for A.O. <laughs> Milton, though. I got you guys. So, guys, we, we, we going hard on the on the merch. A, a big conclusive line going to come out. Um, that B-roll introduction that you guys saw in the beginning. Let me know how you like it. Pretty fire. You know, I got the shirt on. My man got the hoodie on. It's a fact. I'm repping on right here. Right now, uh, employees only. Uh, open an app. Membership. A lot of stuff coming up this year, man. Oh, well, thanks to you guys. Going hard, man. Um, it's a fact. We appreciate you guys, for real. And like I say, I really mean it. I, you know, make sure to comment. I look at all the comments. I answer all the comments. So, if you guys want to talk to me, not around, feel free to hit the comment. Talk to me, me and Milton, and then we check them out. Um, and let us know what videos you guys like, man. We're gonna experiment with a whole bunch of different videos now, pranks, collections, stuff like that. A lot of people asking for to see my collection, man. We're gonna work on it. I'm uh, I don't got too many shoes, man. Just a couple pairs. Not too many. <laughs> <laughs> but uh, we're gonna see what I like. You know, I like to keep stuff I like, and I'm gonna wear. I'm um, talking about wearing. What we got on today, man? I came cozy today. Got some easy 700s. You know, I was came in my work fit today. What you got on today, my guy. Always, he always got heat. You know, always got heat. Room ones, man, gotta wear them. Shout out to my brother Marcus holding it down. That's the family, you ain't know. Those are it. Jeans, and you know, kick cruise a T with our partners over at Chrome Heart holding it down. I'm a zipper up kind of guy, man. I'm, I, like, I like them. We got Adidas, man. What happened to Adidas, bro? That's uh, anybody that knows me knows I collect um, my favorite, favorite, favorite type of shoes. Human races, man. I got old flavors, human races. Most of, I was a friend and family king, bro. I got, when we do that sneaker collection, you're gonna see, man. I, I, after all the new colors and stuff came out, I uh, got a little too crazy for the original five colors, red, still green. still got a couple original here we're holding on to. But, bro, you know. Like the yellow pair, the com pair. Comfort couldn't beat them, man. You Let wear them, I was wearing, I know you know, you wear Jordans all day, your feet hurt. We stand in helping customers. You wear it all day, your feet hurt. So we throw them in there. They started dying down after they released that, but if you know, you know, human race is fire. I don't know what happened to, you know. Then you got four Ds, the first four Ds that dropped. We're going crazy, 1500, 2000. Now Adidas, I don't know, man. They couldn't hold on to the hype. 
What what is the best shoes Adidas got right now? Yeezys. Right? Are they Yeezys? Besides Yeezys. I say Yeezys are fire, bro. bro they, classic. But, you know, the J Jordan came back up, man. And Jordan's killing the game, bro. I remember I, I haven't worn my J's in a little while, and now they're back in style, man. A lot of flavors, a lot of a lot of putting putting them on stuff like that. It's winter time, so I can't even wear my off-white Jordan ones, man. I don't know you. I, I don't know if it's only me, but I see you guys are, like with the Jordan off-white ones. How I got all the flaps on the side and stuff like that. They're more like boots, man. Like, I don't know. Maybe because I'm a bigger guy, but when I put them on, they feel a little weird. Like, I like to cuff them, cover them. And with them on the side hanging out, they, they feel a little big. Yes, you are a bigger guy. I'm trying to lose weight, though. So, you know, coming soon. Uh, so, by me hand, they, yo, you guys you got this that. shit dirty as hell, man. <laughs> but about. <laughs> hey, warehouse manager ain't us. Man, my man was off for New Year's, came out kind of crazy, a lot of box there, we got a lot of cleaning to do. But lo que estaba diciendo es, pa, también para la gente mía, en el español, ya llegamos a los 50 mil subscribers, tenemos más que ahí, vamos a dar un giveaway. Y vamos a sacar la historia de qué exclusive, cómo comenzamos, dónde llegamos. Y también vamos a hablar mucho de tenis, qué tenis son buenos para comprar, qué tenis son buenos para agarrar. And so, with that said, Boom, brings me to this right here, man. Travis Scott Low. Very, very hype shoe, and I don't know if you guys seen it, but the prices are going up right now. I think they're about like 1600 mm -hmm. to 1890. The highs, what? 4000 and up? That, nah, the highs always stayed high as hell, bro. I feel like these is way better. I don't know why these didn't shoot up as much as shoe, the highs. Shoe of the year right here, man. Besides oh, what, what he did and all year. that, but two of the last year, right? It just, it, you know, it comes back to the black. If this was like this high top, crazy. But yo, this actually got me into low tops, bro. I kind of like like low tops those a lot. every single day. Whoa, whoa, excuse me. <laughs> <laughs> I have to That's bleep it. that out, man. <laughs> what you mean, man? I wore my shit. You know what it means? I, I don't, I don't you repeat. Said you gotta I don't, wear, you gotta I don't, wear your shoes. Not hundred percent. I don't repeat too many shoes, but these is probably one of the shoes that I wore the most already. And it just came out. It just they go my go to. And since they low top, it's almost like just get out, get out, get ready, and just. Like Dunks. Them on and stuff like that's that. A fact. Oh, that's why Dunks is fire. Oh, my man got the camera, man. That's a fact. Michigan State Dunks. And with all the laces, you could you could swap sw sw them and stuff like that. They could have done. All sizes from the four thing, but well, how much how much Black. we got these for? When when they released, we did uh, a <coughs> three thousand. <laughs> nah, how much we paid? Uh, when they were coming out, we were, we were buying them for thirteen hundred. Ended up getting a couple hundred pairs for thirteen hundred dollars, and we, we probably got like 50, 60 stashed away, and they slowly just going up. It's just as soon as it, sometimes you gotta look at the shoe, man. Um, it got the hype, so that's a plus. But then again, it's it's, uh, it's beautiful, man. All the extra laces can't get it, enough of these. The one thing to the regardless. White Air Forces, best seller of the year. And right now the Nike up the retail, there's a little drop in Air Forces, man. If you if you guys know, you know. But Air Force is a little hot, hot, hard to get right now. Retail went up to 100. Yeah, yeah, nah, Retail was that. 90, now it's 100. You know what I think? I think Nike's gonna, um, what are they trying to do? I, I, what my suggestion is right now, they they made a whole bunch. They're not releasing, they're, they're letting all the things dry out so they could just change the price to 100. Yeah. And then when they do release, release a lot, and everybody's gonna <clears throat> already be craving for white Air Forces. But in the last year, we went through a lot, man. I'm looking at where we keep them all, and we're looking a little the empty, whole man. Whole shelves were filled. We just over here too. Look at this. We we just picked up a and we just picked up a hundred Air Forces. We had to pay hundred and five. We picked them up for hundred and five. Over retail. Back in the day, we were paying what? The good days was like seventy-two dollars. I was getting a whole bunch, selling them for retail ninety. Last year, we ended up getting them ninety bucks because everybody was going crazy to be able to resell them. But it's crazy how. Um, Keep in mind, we didn't even sell forces. One hundred percent, man. That, that's something everybody recommended. I came, I came from the old school days, man. Trying to get always get away Air Force for the summer stuff like that. 
So when everybody keep asking for Air Force, I try to go out and find them. You know, we don't got Nike accounts, so we try to get for the best price. We were paying 90, man, and it hurt me selling them for 120. Cause it's like, bro, I did 100, but after a couple months, everybody got, got like, yo, everybody know what it is. They, they 120, hard to find. Now that we're paying 105, we're gonna have to up it to 135, stuff like that. But in other places, you see them for 150, 175. The black Air Forces are even crazy. Yep. What are we gonna talk about the mystery boxes, guys? A lot of people wanna know more, so mystery boxes, what are we gonna do? Tell them what we're doing, man. So how many sneakers was there in each box you said? Um, so we're gonna we're gonna uh, put stages to, to mystery boxes. Uh, and what from five to ten sneakers? Yeah, I think we're gonna do like a thousand dollar box. Try to put as much sneakers as we can. We want to make sure that the value is uh, help you guys. You know, man. You you guys know, make a little bit profit on top. You know, God blessed us to be where we are. So we're trying to see what we could give back. You know, without breaking the pockets. You know, what I mean, we could give back to one to two people really good stuff and stuff like that but you know i'm gonna like, be able to cater to a lot of people so with these mystery boxes it's gonna be a pretty big plus uh for the first couple of releases we're gonna record making them so you're gonna see what you're getting you know what i mean and whatever we were overstocked and stuff like that we're gonna give it to almost like retail price that'd be pretty cool Hello. so it's gonna guarantee you some bread what do you think man we're gonna have we're gonna have my man mill make them if he fucks up, you already know. I'm gonna okay, put some okay. heat in for you guys. You never know. You guys, what you want? You guys want Travis's in there? Sheesh. Travis's, mochas. You never know. You never know, bro. Oh, well, for the people, you know, you gotta show them the stack so they, they, they could count, you know? A lot of people like to see the pictures and stuff like that. He said he got over 300, but there's no 300. <laughs> I'm being I'm being modest, man. I think we we got more than three, four hundred shoes. I think we count how many there were. Two, three, what? four. I think there alone is like 180. We got like 20 more in the box. We already started putting some of the bigger sizes away. No. Mocha. Oh God. Bro, we've been Mocha Kings, bro. Been had pairs. This is nothing. <laughs> Remember the video we, we, we did back in the day? Oh, that's a fact. Yo, that's when we first started at TikTok. Yeah. Yo, guys, check out our TikTok. 100,000 on the road, 200,000. We're on the road to 200, you know, 100K on YouTube. Um, I'm going to put the little clip. So when the Mochas first released, we, we probably bought out like two, three hundred. Three hundred pairs. pairs. We knew that, that was really yeah. And how long ago that we was sold a lot of That was what? That was last year. How long ago? When they released. When they, whenever they released. So we're going to put the little clip right there yeah, so you guys can remember. see. That's how old it was. And that's even before we had all the shells and we just started putting everything we none, collected. None of this was there. So it's a little funny. We, we lined them all up and we got a little blooper. I don't know if we show that. When we were lining them all up, taking it off the box, mm -hmm. this guy right here, I sent him to go, yo, do the TikTok video. It was like a domino effect. <laughs> they took like three hours to stack everything up and then he just kicked one off and they all started rolling. When setting up for a TikTok goes wrong. Oh no. And I had to put all them shoes in them boxes back. So imagine. We know we I know who to blame. <laughs> Remember the couple pairs we sell? People coming nah, back. Yo, nah, mismatch, nah, mismatch, nah. mismatch. My man was putting bro, up. What do you expect? Three hundred pairs to put back in each box? <laughs> it's not easy, bro. You two, you two. I'm sorry, sir. We're gonna do this now, or what are we doing? You calling YouTube? Talk to the people, man. Oh, damn, no, no, cut that, cut that, cut that. I'm like, I'm like, cut that, cut that, cut that. I was, I was, yeah, I was gonna show the chrome hard. That's fine. Right. <laughs> yeah, got some fire new chrome hard pieces. I go to all our three locations. Got some new hoodies in. These things is fire. Got and hoodies. I like the one you got. That's oh. the one. It's the conclusive, like I said before. Gotta ask for me, Ayo hey, Miller only. You know, I got the rights to sell it. Yes, sir. <laughs> And with long sleeves in. People, how we teleported here, man? We just took a little drive. Drive from our storage. 
the store. Came back to the Retro Park store. Got all these new pieces we just got in. You guys have been asking for the chrome. We got the chrome. I like this white one though. It's fire. Hoodies. What else we got in? What else we got in? <laughs> Yo guys, listen, 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 man. Appreciate all the love and support. Um, that video that we did for the patent joints. Um, a lot, a lot of people are hitting us up, even with the older releases. They're sending us. Let me see. Let me show the people. They're sending us videos of them squeezing the Jordan ones, asking if they're fake. Okay. So that video, again, is done in camera, in person. You, you guys will see what we're trying to say. But Jordan ones. Um, they're actually the cheapest pair, uh, Jordans that Nike makes. And a little information for you guys, like their production costs and stuff like that is one of the cheapest ones they make. I appreciate you, pass me this one. So we got another shoe. So each of them, depending how Nike feels, they put good quality, bad quality, they, they all vary. So the squeezing part, right on the video that I was trying to show, um, I was just trying to show that it, it squeezes a little easier, but even a, a authentic pair, like this one right here, like I'm squeezing it, it's hard, but you know, if I put a lot of pressure, I still, I still be able to squeeze it. You know what I mean? And then once you squeeze it once, it's like a paper. It, it, it cringes or folds, so the next squeeze is gonna be easier and easier. So don't be squeezing all your pairs. You know what I mean? Like, so I'm, I'm just, I just have to put a lot more pressure and I could squeeze it, not like the other one that squeezed real fast because of the, 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 you know, the sole, whatever do. But then you got these shoes right here, these University Blue ones, depending how they are, but we notice, because you know, it's funny, after the video, we started going through the wall, and we're like, yo, we're gonna start squeezing everything. <laughs> Literally. <laughs> to show you guys, but like, a lot of them is hard, but then we, we came across these right here. These are still hard, but not as hard, and you could get the little squeeze on them. So don't, be, don't squeeze your shoes. Um, the what we're trying to show in the video is that the fake ones squeeze a lot easier than the real one. Mm -hmm. So you gotta have both to like feel the difference. But you know, on the video, I can't um, like make you feel it. So we're just doing it by squeezing it. You know what I mean? But the real pairs, they, they do they do squeeze, guys. So don't be scared. A lot of people are squeezing their whole collection. Oh, is this fake? This fake? Is that? No, it's not. Um, so for example, look, I have this customer here squeezing these University Blue ones here. <laughs> guys don't be afraid guys don't be afraid uh, feel free to send us pictures and stuff like that we'll legit check them that way best best way to legit check is bringing them in person you know a, a lot of people now they, they uh they buy from StockX and just come drop it off we got a couple packages i gotta go through hey guys they always um, ship them out here always let you check them for you if you guys are not too short always you know always guys want a second opinion we're here for you we try we try to you know what is this one from this came from Goodman was this from Hong Kong. DHL, DHL, let's see what shoe it is. A lot, a lot of shoes right now. If you buy on your app and stuff like that, um, are coming overseas. The overseas market is a lot cheaper than the market here. So, um, when you're buying the apps like that, you know, they're gonna send you. So, let's see what these guys got from overseas. Should blur out the address. We don't want to leak nobody. Oh, I already see pan ones after that video. I'm almost positive these are old pan ones. ones. After Maybe a lot of them. Really nice. no problem. Problem. Yeah. This one's good. First best thing you want to do is the lid. Always the lid, but I don't want to make this a legit check video, man. We just get out, but always again, bring your stuff, we check it for you. Just to be sure, just to be sure. For you guys. Oh this one this one's from GOAT. Please don't squeeze us. Wow, they they really look good. Laces, the bottom. Hello, how you doing, man? Good, bro. Um, <laughs> so don't be squeezing all, all your ones. But guys, is uh, don't forget. Guess what we spent on the cash out. Um, man, end the video for my brother. You know, this guy is terrible. <laughs> Now, like always, guys, we appreciate you guys for real. We're blowing up on YouTube. Like, subscribe. If you guys want to see more content, let us know. If you guys want to see something that we haven't done, let us know. We're always saying hey, my ideas. guy. Hey, yo, Mullen, man. We're we trying bro. to get him out there. He, he the plug. He brings a lot of heat and stuff like that. But he, yes, he, he, he's a little camera shy. But everybody is. I was in the beginning, too. A lot of, you know, if you look at my old, old school videos, we were going hard like four years ago, man. If I would have stayed on the YouTube vibes, would have been crazy, especially all the love you guys give us, but we're just 
a couple guys started the dream, trying to show what it's all about. And uh, back, bro. I'm gonna get my man Millen out there, man. He's yes, a little shy, so we throwing him in the camera, man. <laughs> He loves very me. quiet, he, but I'm he very knows a lot of. Yeah, that's what I say. He about sneakers. He knows his things about sneakers. Yeah, man. He put his on. We get a lot of heat from him, man. Unreleased heat. <laughs> Getting some new ones coming in soon, guys. You guys are gonna be <laughs> getting some fire.